I'm here with Stewart County Community College students Aubrey Schumacher and Nicole Piper. How are you guys doing today? Great. Doing good. Now we're going to be here talking about something that you guys created and it's a play called Serial Days. Yes. All right. Uh, when is it when is this performing at the college? It's performing on February 10th and 11th at 7 p.m. Um, it's free to students with their student ID and it's five dollars to the general public. Um, also all first responders get in for free. Okay, great. And um, now, there's something really kind of special about this play, and I'm sure it is to you guys, because you are the guys who wrote it, right? And yes. created it. And actually, it is a completely student-produced, it's a student production, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, so tell us about the play, and what's it about, and how you guys came up with it? Well, uh, it is a thriller comedy about two serial killers meeting on a dating app. Um, it all started around Halloween. Um, we were kind of just laughing at the thought of, you know, like serial killers being on dating apps because we're both fans of true crime and we thought, how funny would it be if two serial killers met on a dating app and they didn't know it and tried to murder each other? And so we kind of just played off of that and then we ended up writing a whole play about it. Mm -hmm. And there's a lot of fun nights trying to come up with concepts and jokes for the play. Now, it's a one-act play, right? Yes. So everything's pretty self-contained? Yes. yes. Okay. Now, I've got to ask you this. So, therefore, a lot of stuff when you write comes from true experience. So, are you guys serial killers or are you guys like dating app fans? Or are you guys both? True crime fans. True crime fans. <laughs> okay. All right. Great. So, um, talk about in terms of that this is a student-create project. Um, how much work has this been? Actually, you, you're... Uh. At, Aubrey, you're directing, and Nicole, you're actually acting. So putting this all together, um, how has it been? Well, many a late night has been spent upon this play. Um, it's been a lot of fun, but there have been a lot of um, rough times getting like pr uh, props together, getting sets built. Those are usually what takes the longest. Yeah, definitely making sure that everyone shows up for practice. <laughs> and comes prepared for practice yes. with their scripts um, and just stuff like that, make you, keep in, keeping them in line, mm -hmm. you know. And it's been a very busy semester this year, especially for a lot of our cast members of whom have full-time jobs <coughs> or are in a lot of <coughs> other clubs, so they're also trying to spend time on this production as well. Um, personally, how has this been a challenge for you guys and how has this really helped you, you know, grow, I guess? I think one of the biggest challenges was just trying to take our vision and put it down on paper. Mm -hmm. That took a long time and then we had to do a lot of revision because after a while we would think it looks good but then we showed it to other people and they're like, wow, that sentence just doesn't sound right anymore because mm -hmm. I had said it out loud so many times I'd forgot how grammar works. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, and as, as the director, just making sure that it's going the way that we envisioned it um, and how we wanted it to be has been a big part of it. Um, just trying to make sure it works for everybody, but mm -hmm. also is what we wanted to see come true. Yes. Right, and I wanted to ask you about that. You know, writing it on paper is one thing. Actually seeing it performed on stage is from you, from your point of view, Aubrey. I'm like, how has that been? <laughs> Excuse me. Has that actually been and actually seeing it develop? It's like, hey, is this what you sort of saw in your head as opposed to being, on the uh, on stage, it's it's coming true for sure. Uh, it's been such a fun time getting them together and watching it develop. Um, I think it'll be a really funny little thirty-minute play for yes. people to come out and see. And Nicole, I imagine it's the same thing as being an actress going out over there, and then you know, instead of reciting the words, like, "Hey, this is how I expected this to be." Yeah. And has it been that way? Yeah, it has. Um, Especially with like my character, we designed them to be kind of a noir-style detective, so finally getting to give that noir monologue is really fun. Mm -hmm. And watching a lot of the other characters come to life has been amazing. Like especially with a lot of the characters I get to hang out with, they're just they're doing great, and it's fun to watch them just develop the character on their own as well. Okay, so um, serial dates will be at the SEC Showcase Theater on this Friday and. This Friday and Saturday at 7 o'clock. 
It's $5 admission, students get in for free, so uh, with student ID. Same thing with first responders, everyone else needs to pay $5. Um, Woody A. B. Kyle, last words that you want to say to people? What kind of, it's, and it's only 30 minutes, so it's a great, it's a nice little respite out of it that you get to sort of see, and it's all student created and produced, so that's who you'll see. Any last words? Uh, please come out and watch the show. We put a lot of love and a lot of hard work into it, and we would love to see the theater be filled up. And I think it's going to be a really fun show, and it'll be a fun date night for a lot of people, so please just come on down and just show us some support. All right, so guys, again, thank you so much for your time. It is on February 10th and 11th at the Showcase Theater at 7 o'clock. Hope you guys enjoy this. Thanks a lot. Bye.